Okay, tree planting. This is, uh, well, the programming makes it look simple, but um, you go to GPS IMU and there's a new thing called tree planting. And here you set your spacing distance. So you want to set it for, say, 90. You set it to zero, then uh, it turns it all off in the program completely. And what it uses, and I'll show it after, is the U-turn byte in the auto steer. So just a single connection with your auto steer. And again, I'll explain that more in text, but uh, you can go anywhere from 10 centimeters to 50 meters on your spacing. So once you have that set and you're all ready to go, then uh, you go with tree planter and that's it. It's just a little control window. Here's your spacing. We set it at 90. The step is the amount of distance that it travels between fixes that are transmitted back to the GPS. Now the thing with tree planting and all these, the faster you go, the bigger the step, the more inaccurate it's gonna be. Because if it jumps 20 centimeters per step, well in 200 milliseconds or 100 milliseconds, you've gone that 20 centimeters. So this, of course, the slower you go, the better it will be. So then all you do at this point is and it turns the manual on. The manual has to be on in order for it to work. And then we just start speeding up. So here, as soon as it hits 90, one tree, two tree. So this number here, the distance to the 90, is what will be sent to the Arduino instead of the U-turn byte. Just this number. Now this number is really easy to decode. Rather than trying to send a signal or a one or a zero, all you do is you read the current one and then you keep a copy of the last one. If the last one is less than the current one, well, you know it's still counting up. But if the current one is less than the last one, you know it's restarted. At that point, you just do a trigger. So simple, simple. So here turns the manual off for you. Line up to your next line. That's how many trees you did. Start, where you go. Here we're going 0.7 kilometers an hour. And go a little faster. Five, six, seven. And then as soon as you hit, also just shut everything off. Now, in terms of the code, um, remember when the thing would spin around and we always had to do the step distance and you have to have two positions kind of far apart in order to get a, a steady heading. Well, that doesn't help with the tree planting. The tree planting, you want every step, every time. So I had to create a, uh, an accumulator that measures the distance between every fix. Now, if you're sitting there and your fix is wandering around, of course, the it's going to increase. But... That's where the start and the stop comes in. As soon as you hit start, as soon as you get going, well, then it will accurately, accurately measure. So we take a, a distance of our current step fix is from our last point to uh, our current fix. And then, so then our tree, spa tree spacing counter is that accumulated distance. As long as our tree spacing isn't zero, that's where setting it to zero turns it off. And then once we hit our tree spacing, we simply subtract the tree spacing. Now this is a while loop in case this number gets really big and you have to keep deleting all the tree spacings until it's less than the actual tree spacing number. And then that's it. And that gives you your, that counter that we see underneath the start stop button. And then our tree spacing is what we set in that uh, display settings in the GPS IMU settings. So that's all relatively simple. So yeah, you would just line up to your spot and away you go. When you get to the end, hit stop, turn around. Get lined up, get going. There you get your trees planted. Done.
Okay, any questions or comments? That'd be great on this tree planting thing. Uh, but it seems to work pretty good. It's really super simple. And uh, we'll go from there. Thanks.